Hey guys, Christopher here. Welcome today to a new tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll teach you guys how to install Ubuntu 14.04 on a Bay 3 Intel processor computer. So recently, recently, I grabbed some cheap computer off um, Taobao, which is a Chinese shopping website. It was like 100 bucks, it was really cheap, um, but Windows ran terribly on it. So I decided to install Ubuntu on it. Um, and the computer has this thing called a Bay 3 processor, which is this new Intel processor that is not as fast as its normal processors, but still quite decent. So the issue with it is that it's quite um, that Ubuntu doesn't really support the virtual processor, and so you know we have to work around it. So this tutorial, I'll teach you guys how to install Ubuntu on your virtual computer processors. So first of all, head over to this link, which is is.gd/bay capital thrill. Oh, what am I doing? Is.gd/bay thrills z. So this link will be in the description below, and so go over to it. And it'll bring you over to this website, um, this Google Plus account by Ian Morrison, who did this amazing thing where he modified the bootloader and stuff in order to allow us um, Bay 3 users to install Ubuntu. So scroll all the way down to the bottom where you see drive, um, this one here, just below, just above the RAM. Is there a RAM? I guess it's a RAM. Open it up and you be brought to this uh, page. Just hit download and um, just download the file. Now once you've done that, go over to Rufus, this website over here, which will also be in the description below, and then download the Rufus version 2.11. So just download that and everything will be okay. All right, so now that you've downloaded both uh, the Rufus and Ubuntu, you need a four gig thumb drive, which I have over here. So just plug your thumb drive into the computer. All right, so once you have time, your thumb drive is plugged in, open up Rufus, run it, and say no. And all right, so now you have Rufus over here. Now select your thumb drive from the device, which is this over here, and click on this little disk over here and go over and select Ubuntu 14.03 Desktop Linux here. Everything should be all set, all good, and just hit Start. Once you've hit Start, um, it will ask you, it will remind you that all data on this will be wiped out. Click OK and carry on the installation. So once you've done that, your, your USB is all ready and head over to the next video where I show you on screen how to install it directly into your um, Base 3 processor computer.